What's up everybody? It's AJ with eTrailer.com. Today we're going to be checking out this combination of locks from Blaylock. So this is going to go on your gooseneck adapter. This one's going to fit the Ram gooseneck adapter. It goes over here on the coupler. And we have one that goes on the set screw to keep your trailer safe when you're not around. Let's check them out. This is going to be a good way to keep your trailer secure. So you can buy these individually, but the fact that it comes in a kit is really nice. We have our Big Tex flatbed trailer here in the parking lot today. And left unattended without these, somebody could just come up, hook up to the trailer, and pull it away. But now we have two anti-theft devices on here, so they can't remove the set screw that would drop the inner tube out, and they can't connect to the coupler. First, we're going to focus on the lock that goes around the set screw. It covers all of it up. We have a padlock on the inside that is included going around a pin that goes in the inside. So it's going to keep anyone from getting to that set screw. But let's show you what goes into it. So we're going to move the padlock first. Just turn the key. I'm going to set that aside. And we'll remove the pin in the middle. There's also a bushing in there to help take up space. So remove that and we slide this off the washer. So what you'd have to do to install this is back off the set screw, completely remove it, put the washer in place so that the cover has something slide into. You see the groove here? That's where the washer slides into to help hold it in place. Like that. Then we just go through the process in reverse. We'll put our bushing in there and our pin to go right through. and then add our padlock. Now you might have to move the bushing to the other side for more room to get that padlock to go through. Looking at our second lock, we're here at the bottom of the gooseneck adapter. You see how this helps protect anyone from getting to the gooseneck adapter to hook up to it. I can move it around, plenty of different positions, but it holds on and stays in place. So this is going to have that padlock, same as before. Remove that. We're bring this pin out and now you can tilt it down to remove it from the adapter so I like that because it is so secure on there even like this you're not gonna be able to get it off there without the pin so the pin just adds even more security with that padlock both of these locks are gonna be made out of airplane grade aluminum they're also going to hold up to the elements, so if you leave them on your trailer outside, the rain's not going to bother it. They won't rust or corrode. They're also lightweight, so really easy to put on there when you need to lock up your trailer. Overall, I like to have the security on the trailer, especially both at the set screw and at the bottom of the adapter, so that I know that if I leave the trailer in the parking lot unattended, nobody's going to be able to mess with it or move it around on me. Well, I think that does it. Thanks for hanging out, and hope this helped.